morning and welcome to Cambridge, Massachusetts. I flew in yesterday. And today I will be partaking in the New Harvest 2018 conference at the MIT Media Lab. So New Harvest is all about cellular agriculture. I just figured I would stick my big fat nose right into the middle of the industry that could potentially disrupt my entire life. Let's check it out. <laughs> Cellular agriculture is essentially the creation of different products using lab technology. Uh, basically growing food, growing things, growing materials in bioreactors. Not so different than how we get our beer now, or insulin, or renin used in cheese. The technology is not super, super new, but it is new when it comes to growing food. convened everyone who is excited about cellular agriculture and who is pioneering in this field. And so we decided to bring in innovators um, all the way from discovery stage research to startups with prototypes. And we also decided to bring in all the people who wanted to get involved in multiple layers of this very complex issue, which is cellular agriculture, which is not only complex scientifically, but also in how it actually emerges into the world. Memphis Meats is a food technology company that makes meat, poultry, and seafood products directly from animal cells. Today, we publicly debuted beef, chicken, and duck products, and our finished products are meat, real, familiar meat, the kind that consumers can buy and eat right now. Of the amount of myoglobin that we have in, in the muscle, the hemoglobin gets the oxygen to the cells, the myoglobin stores it. Depending on the activity of that muscle, it'll depend on the amount of oxymyoglobin that's there that can be utilized. It's not bad. They're called photoinitiators and they're stimulated to react with the extracellular matrix with light. So we're able to show that we can actually perfuse these spinach leaves now with whole blood. So we feel pretty good. We're able to, to perfuse them. We did some work and, you know, again, I heard uh, about collaboration. <laughs> I'm an industrial designer over at Ecovative Design. We make mushroom-based materials, and today we're going to check out the giant lounge chair that we grew in nine days. I love it. I'm New Harvest Research Fellow and PhD candidate at Tufts University, uh, and today I'd like to talk to you about uh, cellular metabolism as it relates to cultured meat, containing life within that cell. And in reality, this is a very simple cartoon of what cellular metabolism is, uh, and it's actually a very complex... What we are aiming for, we, uh, which is basically democratized cellular agriculture. Designer Plants, there's a startup here uh, in Cambridge that represents this kind of idea that we're able now to move biology into computation. We think uh, openness is basically, uh, it's not an advantage to move, but something crucial, which we just, just have to be done. And our purchases today are not just about the things we eat, but they're an extension of the values we, we hold dear. We're able, with our purchases, to display our interest in sustainability, in social justice, in animal welfare. I, I got down the rabbit hole and that's how I found you guys. I found this amazing space with all these innovators. And I, I'm not sure cellular agriculture is going to be the disruptor, but it certainly has the potential. 
the opportunities in the in the short and medium and long term are astronomical. So thank you guys so much. When it hits you, yes, 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 you shall. When it hits you, yes, 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 so I just wanted to document that I went out for supper with an entire table of vegetarians. Everybody's a vegetarian, yes? You can confirm uh, this? Yes. Mostly, for the most part, vegetarians. Guilty. And uh, they, they ordered veggie burgers and hummus, and I got a beef burger. I just wanted to point that with out. With bacon. With bacon. Oh. And they're all super jealous. <laughs> they're gonna have They're gonna have secret McDonald's tonight when they're by themselves. Just <laughs> raging. I see tomorrow. Yeah. I'm not I'm not shy. Oh, you're shy. Oh, you're shy. Bye, guys. Okay, day one finished of the New Harvest Conference. It was intriguing. I learned a lot of things. This cellular agriculture space is interesting. I learned about how you can make roast chicken smell. I ate a piece of chicken gum. I learned that you can make meat in a modified microwave using Powerade in the do-it-yourself category. I learned about pork sausages that don't require pigs. I met a guy who made a chair out of mushrooms. There was this doctor and he decellularized spinach and then put cells back in and he can pump blood through spinach veins. Right? I learned that coffee flavored Soylent isn't that bad. Okay, I'm gonna walk back to the hotel now. That's it. That's the day. That's a wrap. See ya. Stay out of my gas hole. <laughs>